Gods and goddesses, how can you expect to learn if you never make mistakes? My name's Anuki and this is Smite. Top 5 Plays. Behold my power! That so Luna X is back with us again, here to lend Guan Yu their assistance. Circuit can't tear down Guan Yu faster than so Luna can shred them into the belly of the dragon. So Luna isn't holding back. And Guan Yu's definitely screwed. Guess we'll want me free now! Ganesh looking delicious for the money storm is so funny when it doesn't hit, weaving in out of Kronos and cutting those basic attacks, delaying for cooldowns, swinging at every old dragons directed at Kronos. He's getting burned, he's getting chunked, he just got dropped! Kernanos can wait. So Luna water illusions away, not remain in stealth, but Kernanos is following up, but he's not following through. The glaives aren't touching, so Luna is strafe, strafe, strafing up another kill. Ganesh, no, no, they're a little late. It's a four course meal. Dessert is putting up a struggle, but I think that's the way so Luna likes it. Never stood a chance. Arriving at the mid harp is easy money, easy XP for Nevi, but he did not foresee an unhelping hand. Breaks free to avoid becoming jump and responds with my favorite level 3 spell, Gust of Wind, and summons Athena. Pulls them into the waffle stomp. It's a speedy hot foot of a play that allows Nevi to walk away with ample pay. Great time, let's look at some submissions that didn't quite make it. And if you're interested in gems, which who isn't, come join my live stream Friday, Saturday, Sunday. For every Smite victory, we'll be doing a gem giveaway. Come on, boost me, I need the wins! That's 3 p.m. EDT, 8 p.m. European time. For more information, visit discord.gg forward slash Anuki TV. Now, let's get back to the action. Right between the eyes. BB Dorgado now doubling up with Sobek. They've scared off their lane opponents, but that might have just been a ruin for this Achilles to blink through the wall. They're targeting the support, as often is the case in the early game. Sobek's trying to wriggle free, but he needed to have tried harder. All the while, BB Dorgado plucking away the Achilles and gets that revenge. Dorgado kiting into the jungle, deploys the trap car and activates it, makes for easy shooting. Double kill. The minions, they're here for you, BB Dorgado. Let's get clubbing. <laughs> That big minion is off for a jungle buff. They should fear me now. Justice shall be done. Terrigal and Fire seem to be down one friend. Nox shadow lashing out and sticks the combo. This is a great time to engage. Kelly moves in with the kill, watches out for the jump. Surprising to see the jump on the spot. A swift impale on Kelly, sends her back against the wall. Tyrigal boxing them in, keeping them out of play with the Desert Fury to pierce. Now that's teamwork. However, Fire's low on health. We're at the point where everyone's got a single strong ability. The rest are pretty weak. Fire has got the moves. Avoids the shockwave, tells Nox to knock it off, tells Geb to get off of me. Tyrigal playing protectively. Geb might not hit hard, but we're fighting for scraps of HP here. Fire dodging well, hides behind the pillar as he lets his teammate solo. Knocks inside Geb. No way you'll be able to recall fire. The shockwave hits. The shadow explosion hits the life steal. The much needed essence of life from attacking. That's a 2v3 in the bag. My name is Swag. Red team taking out the trash, swatting the flies and closing in on the prize. There's just one Tongu little problem. Launching all the meteors, only one hits, gets two Aegises, one of them burning their pants, and now Embered. Rad bling, Tongu skitters, then turns to return fire, literally, and missed. But that's okay, back to what matters, the Phoenix. And it's going down rather slowly. Tongu skips around the wall, rains fire upon her bois. The flame wave just reaching. Another water type to try and drown out the flames. Poseidon's met with Nagus, enthusiastic Kraken. Tongu used dash, another victim for the burn ward. Extra crispy. Making it rain, Sobek dashing forward so it's missed. Noxus fumes extending the reach. What a great move, but not enough to kill. Ratataska now on the flank. It's a head-on charge past each other. That fire leaves Cinder's bow, and Rat gets cocked. Only the support left and here to claim the glory, Mercury! Oh, wow. With plays like that, there's no way Tongu is single. Okay, immortals, submit your play using the link in the description. Any troubles, come find me on discord.gg and Nuki TV. And don't forget to sub to the channel for your new Water Dancer skin. See you for the next episode of Top 5 Plays.